Welcome to the Royal Club Sweat Cap video. This is my Facebook account, so I don't plan on changing that picture for any time soon. I accept all uh, friend ads, and uh, yeah, I could use some Entropia Universe friends on my Facebook. I post my art. I also sell art from here. That's another way I make money. Not much, I tell you that. Okay, now, here's uh, Entropia Universe. The game I'm currently addicted to. I think I'm going to stick with it for a while. Um, what I like about it is it can be really fun. It basically costs me a pad a day to shoot. So, to play eco on this game, I try not to hunt too much, just to save money until I build up uh, my, my, my savings of ped, which is 30.01 ped right now. Hey, it's not a lot. I've made all that from Entropia Partners radio station, which I encourage everyone to get on. So, I have not put a single cent into this game, and I have no plans to anytime soon. Uh, there's no need. Um, I'm sweating, and I'm making money, and I'm listening to a radio station. And I just died, and that's okay. Um, I do something different when I sweat. After the creature goes dry, I go and attack the creature solo. What that does is increase um, my skills like evade, combat reflexes, concentration, athletics is a good one. And these things are all going to help later on when I go hunting. Uh, the more skills you have, it appears to me as far as I can figure out, the, the less ammunition I'll be using. <laughs> Especially if I get my uh, ranged laser rifle, rifle skills up, etc. So here's my computer set up for today. Huh. Okay, I have EverQuest where um, I've been playing since 2002 off and on. I make no money here. I still like it. I'm playing three accounts of this. So I don't have to rely on anyone and I'm away from keyboard a lot. So I'm in the steps fighting with my own group and I don't have to rely on anyone. And we have Entropy Universe here with uh, my girl in her underwear. And I am making money with this game so huh, I wonder which game I'm going to play. Um, now supposedly making videos is another way to make money <laughs> so um, on YouTube I've generated but not claimed about a hundred and twenty eight dollars so far and uh, I'm approaching a million hits on this channel I can't wait to, to hit that mark it's been a long time coming all right, so what game am I going to play, huh? The one that makes money or the one that doesn't, huh? Well, I'll play both because both are fun. <laughs> and me being happy uh, keeps me alive, so I'm going to play both. Screw it. I'm going to extra effort not to swear today in this video. <laughs> the last one, I said a curse word six times and there was some delay on the video being monetized so I'm gonna try and keep it clean though that's not my favorite thing to do to be honest I'd rather swear profusely because what does it matter it's just English right and it's uh, our current day vernacular every day outside in the mission in San Francisco I hear all kinds of curse words it's how people talk 
Why I can't swear on YouTube is beyond me, but that's how it is. Okay, here we are. I put the camera on a tripod. Let's sweat. I like the sound effects in Entropia Universe, but I turned off the music because the music is terrible in this game. It pales in comparison to something like Age of Conan, which has an amazing soundtrack I can listen to over and over again. Okay. The name of this land is El Dorado. It's owned by Royal Club Society. I don't know what's going on with them. They claim to be the biggest society in the game. Hey! Look at that chick in the green pants. Yeah. Look at that derriere. It looks just like in real life. She's a cool chick. I wonder what her name is. But, Sandra. But we know that's a guy. Just like I'm a guy playing my female tune in her underwear. But these, this green pants girl, she looks cute. I see uh, yoga girls that look like that in real life. Right outside where I live, they're going to yoga class all the time. <laughs> I really like girls. I talk to them at the bar. If they're interested in my artwork. Okay, this is going to be the thing that I always do when the creature is dry. I just try and solo one of these creatures. And I'm going to die. So, an exploit in this game that you can do is there's no penalty for death. So just go ahead and die over and over again. What does it matter? The truth is, it doesn't matter if you die in this game. You lose nothing. See? I gain experience in my athletic skill. Sometimes I can pull off some uh, bottles of sweat, too. See? There you go. Three. I'm a sweat gatherer level two, and I am jonesing to get to level three. I can't wait. There was a big difference between Sweat Gatherer level 1 and level 2. So at level 3 I'm really going to be pulling in even more, more, even more bottles of sweat. The highest Sweat Gatherer in the game, he's level 56 from what I understand. Took him years. And no one knows, according to the people that hang out here, what the highest level of Sweat Gatherer is. Takes a really long time to level up as a sweat gatherer. But from what I understand, the better you are at it, the more sweat you get. The more sweat you get, the more you can sell. The more you can sell, the more money you get. <laughs> the faster you can collect 10,000 bottles of vibrant sweat, the better. Yeah, I can do this all day. I consider this my job. And hey, earning three bucks in a video game is a real accomplishment for me. I've never been able to do that before. I think it's amazing. Okay. That's what I wanted to show in this video. Thanks for watching. And, uh, yeah, I mean, link me a video. I'll watch it. I don't have any friends who make videos. Not even on Facebook or anything. I don't know why. I mean, you can generate income from it. I guess because it's hard work or something. I don't know. Well, thanks for watching.